card is so 70s, isn't it? I always say that, but every time it flips out, I just it's just so funny because it's so 70s. Capricorns, Capricorns. New beginnings. Okay. New okay. beginnings in work, money, or new beginnings in love for you. You're an earth sign. The pentacles represent earth signs. Or you have a new beginning with another earth sign. Okay. New beginnings, new beginnings, new beginnings. Now, what's interesting is you may not feel ready for the new beginning yet. They may not feel ready for the new beginning yet. Even if you're in a committed bond, okay, the reason why I'm saying this is because we have the Ten of Cups reversed. So this is a card of emotional fulfillment. So if you're just meeting somebody, obviously you're not going to have this complete emotional fulfillment. You're not going to be wanting to propose and have children and buy a house just yet, okay? So you're a little unsure, or they might be a little unsure about where it's going. So... This isn't really the thought right now. Maybe even a little complacency is the thought right now because, you know, am I really ready to date? Do I really want to? I still want to be back together with my ex, but this person kind of seems great too. Okay. Now, if you're in a long-term bond, maybe there have been some job adjustments, career adjustments, financial adjustments, and you're kind of in that mode where your focus is elsewhere. Okay, and it's not bad. It's not completely impacting your relationship, but sometimes your focus needs to be on something else for a minute. Okay, five of pentacles reverse is what is grounding you in April, Capricorns. Now, what this means is that nobody's feeling left out in the cold. So, if the focus is, and I'll tell you why it looks like it is. Okay, if the focus is moving towards something else for the time being, it's not because you don't love your partner anymore. It's not because they've fallen out of love with you. Maybe there's just higher priorities for a minute. Okay, you always come back and circle back around to your partner because remember, they're your rock. They're your grounding. But sometimes priorities shift for a while. So this states no one's going anywhere. Okay. You're safe there. What's crowning you is the Seven of Wands reversed. So this means that there's no need to have any defenses up. You or your partner won't be defensive. Whatever's going on in your life with respect to outside of love, if you're in a long-term bond, uh, it's a situation where you're not worried, okay? You're not worried that your partner's leaving. They're not going anywhere. And there's no fighting. It's kind of, this is our plan. I'm behind that her. I'm behind him. This is what we've agreed to do together. All right. If you're just dating, you're not worried. You're having fun. You, no need for any defenses to be up. There's new beginnings all around, so you're really excited about that. And so you're not really feeling rejected or left out in the cold at all because you're just it's something new. In your future, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Okay. Queen of Pentacles reversed could indicate sudden changes in Finance. Now, if you have a new job, it takes a while for those, that money to transfer into stability. So there could be issues with money where that's causing you to not feel in your peak. All right. You always put so much work and effort into work that if it's something that's new, if it's a new job or new career, it does take time before you start really feeling like you have your, your footing. Okay. That can impact your relationships. And I'm really likening this to you, Capricorn, in the future, the next few weeks, because you're just going to be feeling a little bit off kilter. Okay, not a lot, but you're not going to feel completely in control of a situation. With respect to love, you're not going to feel completely in control of a situation. You're unsure. Okay, but you are wanting a solution and you are wanting a resolution because it, we have the hangman in your how you feel about the situation position. It's reversed. 
Okay. The hangman reversed means uh, hastening up. So maybe there was a little bit of a delay, but there's not any right now. Or your energy is saying, I can't handle this delay anymore. I need answers. I need change. I want this. I want that. So while there may be some brief adjustment temporarily, you, you realize you only want that temporarily. You're only going to put up with it for so long. And then you need to be back to normal. Okay. How they're feeling about the situation. And this is beautiful, Capricorns, because they do want to rush in and make change. Okay. They don't want delay. They want to make adjustments and be together or move forward with love life quickly. They don't want the delay either. So at least you're on the same page with that. Okay. Your hopes and fears, king of pentacles, your hope, you're fearing, okay, this is not a hope. You're fearing greatly that this kind of insta unstable feeling, maybe money-wise, maybe love-wise, the how unstable it is, it's you're worried that it's going to prolong. But just know that it won't. They're wanting to make changes. They're willing to do whatever it takes to make changes. And you want them to make the changes as well. So don't be afraid. Okay. Now in your final outcome for April, Capricorn, we have the Ten of Swords. So there is going to be an ending of a phase. If this is a new position or a move or a new person, it takes some getting used to. And as you're getting used to it, or as the money starts coming in, it's like, okay, now I finished that stressful phase. Now it's time to start a new happy phase. Okay. So whatever it is, whatever you're worried about, whatever is impacting you with respect to your love life, Capricorns, it's going to be coming to an end. Okay. The issue, the worry, it's going to be coming to an end. This part end can also represent being stabbed in the back, getting hurt, being left. But it kind of looks like they're not leaving. They don't want to. They want to fix something. Change will definitely be the case, though. Okay. All right. What are the overall messages for Capricorn's love life in April 2017? Overall messages for Capricorn's. Knight of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. Wow, Capricorn, this is all you. This month is about you. Putting your head down and focusing on work. Holding on to your tenants, okay? If, if this could really represent, I know this is supposed to be a love reading, Capricorns, but this could really represent a new position and holding on to your money and being very frugal until you until you feel settled in the job, safe in the position, okay? And then the Knight of Pentacles, slow progression, slow development, slow growth, okay? Slowly moving forward, one step at a time. This reading's all about you, uh, Capricorns. Ace of Pentacles, from the, from the beginning to almost the end. Eight of Pentacles, work, continued efforts. Staying frugal, holding in, making efforts, slow, strong, sure efforts. And until you get to here, you're not going to feel like yourself. Okay? And in order to get yourself to feel like yourself, work. Okay? It's almost as if love is not, you know, your partner is going to be here. They're willing to do whatever it takes. They're not going anywhere. We already talked about that. It's definitely a trustworthy situation. So if you need to focus on work right now, make sure you communicate that to your partner and say, hey, I need a month or two or a couple months. I need to just do my thing. And then we can, I'll, I'll be back. Okay, I'm not saying take a break, but communicate that so we know what's going on. 